Hello, this is Rob Hirschfeld with RackN and a hot take on infrastructure as code that we discussed on the November 24th DevOps Lunch and Learn. And infrastructure as code is very aspirational. There's a lot of things that people want our infrastructure automation to become. Things that have reconciled our patterns and managers and uh, source code control and, and collaborative social reuse of code. Amazingly important things. Um, and I think to make all that happen, we need to converge towards a definition that is simple and understandable. Um, but it's, it's really important. Automation is really hard. Um, and doing it well in ways that we can reuse that automation, that we can make our different infrastructures, which are good and different for, for good reasons, abstracted in useful ways that encourage reuse is super, super important. So. I know people don't always get excited about a definition experience, but at the same time, I think in defining infrastructure as code, we're describing how we want to interact with infrastructure. And that's my takeaway uh, for any conversation about infrastructure as code. It's really a question of what should automation be like? What should our infrastructure um, act like as we go through the process of of fixing it so that it, it answers our needs uh, from a business perspective. Enjoy. Uh, check out the November 24th DevOps Lunch and Learn on the2030.cloud where we discuss this and this will be part of our ongoing conversation where we're tackling that, um, complexity, serverless, uh, DevOps in general. Uh, a lot of fascinating conversations there. Please join in. It's conversational. We want to hear what you have to say. Thanks.